And this is just to get to the airfield, and then we're gonna fly around, and then we're gonna have to attach and Oh yeah, baby! Woohoo! Little jank, little jank. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Woo! Okay, we're good. That was a little scary. <laughs> like, uh, it's not coming down. Alright, here we go. We are approaching the kind of entrance here. Start dropping her down nice and low here. Should be able to fit under this uh, bridge here, no problem. What up, everybody? Welcome back to another video. And at this episode, we have Dawson here who uh, is finally finished building his uh, little hover hovercraft, aircraft, wing glider slash makeshift death trap, whatever you want to call it. And uh, we're going to be taking it up in the air today to see how it uh, holds up, uh, if you will. So nice bright uh, colors here to stand out out in the uh, county. And uh, we got our Tahoe. We got everything all hooked up. Um, boy, did this take a long time and a mess. I Mainly because I didn't know how to do it. So uh, shout out to Sean for showing me how to do all this. <laughs> it was uh, a little bit of a mess trying to get trying to get it to uh, get everything attached. And then uh, AI traffic, you know, semis were just coming down in here and blowing shit up. And we had to close the road down. It was an absolute mess. So uh, hopefully I don't have to relive that nightmare. But anyway, enough with that said. We're going to get out here. We're going to uh, do, we're going to drive this. We're going to take it over to Grapeseed Airfield uh, is kind of where we're going to lift off at, where we're going to start. Um, uh, Mackenzie Airfield and uh, stupid chimes. Uh, actually, I almost forgot to fill up the uh, Tahoe here with gas. I didn't really think about that. We're not going to be able to... Uh, Oh, can't refill more than 25% with the... Well, that's a problem. Because uh, we're not going to be able to pull into a gas station. Well, what we'll have to do is we'll have to drop the trailer off. And then we'll have to uh, pull around, get gas and, and whatnot. So we'll have to go to um, the big gas station here to have enough room. So uh, we got to watch our clearance here um, as we're transporting this item. So, when we go through the uh, tunnel, that could be an issue. We'll probably have to take up the middle of the lane to be able to do that. Because if we hit this on something, it could explode. So, <laughs> we're going to have to take things uh, very careful. We're not going to cut there. We're going to take it nice and wide. Oh! We probably should have just gone straight and got, went out to the highway, honestly. But... Ugh, we're testing her. We're good. So we might get pulled over for this. I, I don't really know if this is something that you would need a escort for or something like that. There's a cop right here. We're going to be passing. <laughs> hey. There's a state troop right there. Hey. <laughs> People are like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> There's somebody uh, working at that factory that said something. I didn't hear what he said. Yeah, so we're going to have to pull in here. We're going to have to detach the trailer and get gas. At I mean, we're going to do it at this gas station because it's the biggest. Um, and we've got the most space to do it with. So, Oh, and we're already getting stopped. Well, you're going to have to wait till I get pulled in, dude. I should have known that was coming. Oh, yeah, he's coming. Woo, I didn't think about that. Uh, hold on. I'm going to... Oh, oh, that's a problem. Uh, that wing is going to cut the, uh, yeah, that's a problem. <laughs> well, when we're done here, I'm going to have to uh, have him move and I'm going to have to back out or back up a little bit. Because otherwise I'm going to hit my wing on that fucking tanker trailer now. What's up, man? Man, I went like 20 feet and you're already coming. <laughs> All right, well, we're just... um. Asking to pull over today just to ask you a couple questions about the uh, your payload. I mean, we got it all strapped down and and all that, and I mean. I'm, I'm more talking about like the wingspan, or is there any way that we could like collapse it? Oh, uh, hmm. can't really fold those things on that. Uh, no, nah, I mean I've just been taking it wide. Uh, most cars are, I mean, they go right under it. So. Are you able to take like uh, bolts out, and take the wings off, or is that? Is it all just one big piece or something? 
Yeah, it's kind of like a, uh, you know, it's a wing glider, so I, I mean, some of them might collapse, but this one, I mean, it's no, as you could tell, it's no uh, professional grade, you know, built type right. uh, thing. Just drive the Duke out of tension, especially when it comes to like tunnels and bridges and stuff like that. Yeah, that one might be interesting, I was just thinking about. Especially because you're going towards um, Sandy Shores, and I don't know how you'd go through the tunnel. Yeah, I might have to go in the middle or something. Unless you'd like an escort through the tunnel. Uh, might not be a bad idea. I gotta get gas here, though, before anything. Alright, well, I think it'd be smart to detach the trailer before you get gas. Yeah, I'm gonna detach the trailer and then... But now, now this wing is gonna catch on the tanker trailer, so I'm gonna have to back up and... <laughs> yeah, okay. The car look like just so you don't hit it. <laughs> Why is he running like that? <laughs> The way that they was running, he's like, oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. all right, let's uh, detach the trailer. All right, yeah, decouple this. Right, do you need help detaching it? Yeah, it should be okay here. All right. Yeah, I'm sure. Uh, you know, you haven't seen these these around too much out here. <laughs> what do you need help? Wow, does this you know wing glider right here? Cause this is home. This is homemade right here, man. So what what plans do you have for this glider? Uh, yeah, we're going, uh, I got a buddy, we're going out to, uh, the, uh, Mackenzie Airfield, he, he's letting me take off there, so. Oh, okay. And whatnot, because otherwise, you know, Sandy Airfield's a little bit too cluttered, and that's kind of more for planes and stuff, so. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, well, just detach, make sure you detach for your refuel, because you obviously want no explosions. Yep, yep, we should be good with the decoupled here, and I'll... And then once you get back on the road, we'll give you an escort through the tunnel. All right, that'd be mighty dandy. All right, so let's get gas. I had a feeling that wouldn't take very long. <laughs> Already was getting pulled over. So yeah, we need gas, and then we'll yeah. I mean, if they want to do the escort or do an escort through the tunnel, I mean that that'd be fine because otherwise we're gonna have we're gonna have to take it through the middle anyway. So um, it's gonna be a little jank going through there. So. <laughs> Power good there. Hey bro, can you uh can you unscrew the wings on there or like disattach uh, like detach it? Uh or... no, I was telling your uh buddy I, I mean this one's uh homemade the way that the wingspan's set up and whatnot, I can't really fold it. I mean it won't really make a difference. Can you Yeah take if he folds it off? be too high. Do I? Can you take the wing off? Mm. But if you took the wing off, where would he put it? Um, <laughs> it'd be to too call. big. We'd have to just call a tow truck for him to put it on the bed. Um, I, know, I think the best scenario would just be an escort. Thank you. Come on, man. Like so I, so because obviously, like if that if damage, it can explode. I can't do anything with it. this. Like out of RP, I can't it fold it. I can't, you know. It, it should be. It's it's a two lane small tunnel it's it's definitely not gonna fit so guarantee you that thing's not gonna fit if it does i'll be very surprised nah surprised. we'll be good he's advocating for me over here he we're, we'll be good yeah <laughs> so just get a tow truck station the uh beginning of uh brad jack tunnel so if it does not fit we'll just unscrew that wing entirely put it on the bed of the tow truck and then uh you'll be good to go the rest of the other way does that sound like a plan yeah, man. I think we can take our chances. Okay. We could do Joshua to Seaview, or we could do Route 13 to Union. Yeah, yeah. so um, we'll continue down the U.S. Route 1. Uh, we'll pass the Bad Drug Tunnel, and then that first entrance into Grape Seed, we'll follow that. We'll go down Jode Lane. <coughs> um, take a left. Uh, Joe Dane, and we'll take a right on Sea View, and then we'll enter into the Grape Seed Airfield. But does that sound uh, like a deal to you? Uh, yeah. Are you gonna have a guy in front too, or is it just in the back? Or we'll have a guy in front and a guy in the back. Okay. And essentially, it'll uh, it'll be an escort all the way down there, and then when we need to make a right turn or whatnot, um. Since you'll be on the phone, we'll communicate with you. We'll tell you to like slow down or like come to almost like a complete stop. 
so we can block off the correct lanes make sure no vehicle comes towards us when you're turning and then uh when we give you the green uh, go ahead uh, you'll make the turn itself okay all right well i appreciate you know this is kind of cool man i i don't want to take up your resources but we got plenty don't worry <laughs> i'm just gonna well he's excited <laughs> like, yeah he is sorry i'm a little slow sometimes oh there we go how do I how do I answer this thing? Uh, you gotta pop it back up, uh, and then I think it's that green thing right there. Oh god! Oh. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Gotta have brain damage now. <laughs> yeah. Hello, 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 hello. Yeah. Oh, is it working? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you hear me? Okay. I forgot they have a phone script now, so I was like, oh, that's what he was talking about this whole time. <laughs> God dang it. All right, let the escort begin. Hold stationary for a second. And this is just to get to the airfield, and then we're going to fly around, and then we're going to have to attach and... Oh, yeah, baby. Woohoo. Are you going to make your turn? Never had an escort like this right, before. Pull over slightly so I can go past. <laughs> All right, we're clear there. So yeah, we're gonna get to the airfield. We're then we'll do our flying, and then we'll have to leave and come back. So I don't know if they're gonna stop me again later or what. But if the tunnel's coming up. This will be the interesting part. I think we'll be just fine. He didn't. Th he didn't think that right, we got to turn ahead. Uh, prep for that turn. It's quite wide one. All right. He didn't think that we could make it, but I think if we go in the middle, we'll be just fine. So, woo! Um, yeah, I mean, it is a tight tunnel, but like I said, if we go in the middle, we should be right, just speeds fine. are gonna slow down to around 15 miles per hour when we go into the tunnel. All right. It's kind of hard to do 15. I have to go about 20. Woo! All right, you clear? Yep. Fantastic! We're good. Bravo! We made it. Yeah, bravo. We'll we're in the middle and let's go. See, we're just fine. We have several, you know, probably four, four to five feet on each side clearance, so we're good. We are Gucci. Just trying to stay steady here. Don't accidentally fucking veer off to the side because then it's over. All right, there we go. Come back over to the side. I gotta watch that tree there in the pole. There you go. How about this? Give me just one second. I can't. Yeah, at that angle, we should have come. You should have come the Union way. Uh oh. <laughs> All right, I think that's gonna be your best bet to enter through there. The other one is uh, even slimmer. Oof. All right, uh, I'll just have to take her wide, go off into the beach a little bit. What was that? Yeah, just uh, go straight a decent you, uh, bit and then uh, obviously make it right. Yeah, I'll just have to cut it off into the beach a little bit there. Okay. We're going to continue straight. There's another way we're going to get into the airfield. Oh, okay. Unless we're doing it right. Okay, no, we're doing it right here. here All right. right, you can swing in a whole traffic for you. All right. Oh, I don't know if this is gonna work. Oh no. There you go. Alright, you got it, you got it. Just slightly to the left a tad bit more. Left, left, left. Your wing's not gonna hit that. Watch your wing to the tree on your right. Okay, we're there good. Go. The good job, good job. Enter on the airfield. You got an obstruction to your right. Watch that. Good job. Holy shit. We Fantastic. actually made that. <laughs> Run over. Hey guys, I really appreciate that. No problem. Anything you can do to help, you know, let us know. Sounds good. It's perfect time morning here, so we'll get her out, get her up. Yep. And, uh, 10 o'clock. Hopefully, uh, yeah. you don't find me in the ocean, but, you know. Hopefully, hopefully not. not. Hopefully not. You stay <laughs> safe with that, all right? All right, brothers. See ya. Fly right. safe, man. Stay safe. Yep. yep. You guys are out. Stay safe, guys. Yep. Yeah. All right. They did good. Yeah, I... Didn't know if we would cut that, make that coming at that angle like that, but we did. So, um, all right. So now 
we don't need that much runway, I don't think. So we're probably just gonna, we're gonna back this up to the end. Uh, back her up. Woo. Um, that's fine, actually. Let's just take it off to the right. Uh, how far can we go? Okay, a little bit more. Because when we drop it, that wing's going to hit the trailer. Uh, what is it? Page down to drop it down. There we go. Look at that. Came right off just fine. All right, we got her uh, all fired up here. Everything's looking good. Just do a little test here, make sure she's good. All right. Let's uh, get her going. Woohoo! All right. And lift her up. There she goes. Up, up, and away. Just like that. How about that? Oh. Let me take my sunglasses off. They're kind of bugging through on this. There we go. Dude, that's like so chirpy. <laughs> Woo. Yes, yeah, so this thing doesn't go very fast, so we may have to land in Sandy and get fuel. I just, I'm a little worried. Um, we could land, there's the small runway. We're not going to land on the large, huge runway. We're going to land on the smaller side one. And uh, do that. Let me cut the engines off. I mean, it is a glider, so let me see if, how it just glides. Let's see if she just glides nice up here. Um, okay, she's dropping a little bit. Maybe because we're not high enough. But she should just glide nice once we're set in stone. Probably shouldn't be testing this with low fuel. Little jank, little jank. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Woo! Okay, we're good. That was a little scary. <laughs> I was like, uh, it's not coming down. Alright, so we landed it. Let's just fill up on fuel. That way we're not freaking out. And then we'll go back up. Oh, dead. Okay, there we go. We have to fill it up on the helipad. <laughs> It, uh, it uses the gas script. We can't use a jerry can when there's that much fuel or, or something. The way that the fuel script is set up, so that's fine. We'll just hurry up and get out of here. All right, we got all gassed up. Let's take uh, the same runway that we did to land. That way we're not occupying the big runways for no reason. And we'll do this third person on this one. And boom, she just lifts right off like that. And that is that. So I wanted I want to try the gliding thing again. I made I need to get higher up. I wasn't high very high up when I was trying to glide. So let's uh gain some altitude here. And uh we'll do it. Make it I've gotta make sure to stay clear of the mountains and, and all that. I think it'd be cool if we can glide like right through the uh, wilderness park and all that. That'd be pretty cool. Or maybe glide over Alamo. That'd be cool too. So let's see how high we can actually go with this. I don't really know what the uh, limit is. Now we're about 700 feet now. Well, 
shit, we're over a thousand feet. Damn, okay, we're actually climbing really, really good here. All right, let's cut her off. Okay, she's off. And she is starting to plummet. Oh, glider. Oh, there we go. Okay, now she's gliding. There we go. I was like, what's the point of a glider? <laughs> yeah, she's actually holding 1,200 feet pretty nicely. Pretty close to 1,200. We haven't really lost that much. Uh, that much, you know. Height. It all just kind of depends on the air. You kind of dip down and then you pull back up and... Yeah, look at that. Just gliding on by. <laughs> Let's do some uh, low flying across uh, Wilderness Park. Mount Chile to Wilderness Park. Let's find and go over that way. Do some low flying throughout those uh, waterfall and the trees and stuff. All right, here we go. We are approaching the kind of entrance here. Start dropping her down nice and low here. Should be able to fit under this uh, bridge here, no problem. Do some of that. There we go. Right under her, oh yeah, no problem. Gotta watch her on the mountain side here. Now that bridge we may go over because that's a little pushing it there. <laughs> so nice and peaceful though. You know, some this is the kind of stuff that people kind of overlook with RP and that, where you know people think it's it's all about. You know, gang banging and stealing cars and robbing and, you know, it's just little, little things like this, you know. Actually, we can fit under this one. I don't want to try to pull up and go over it now at this point anyway, so. There we go. Could probably even beach land this thing. Like, it's that, you know, could land it on a beach if you really wanted to. We're going to go ahead and uh, land it here since the sun is going down. So we're going to go ahead and try to woo, put her down. We are still way too high up, though. Oh, boy. We're going to be nose diving. <laughs> this is uh, not going to go good. Put her down, put her down, put her down. Woo. Okay, a little rough, but we're good. We put her down. <laughs> Oh boy. We're just gonna have to rotate her around to try to attach her on the trailer here and, and get her done. Let me shut the engine off. Alright, let's go ahead and try to attach this. I had to bring the tra or the aircraft closer. So we mark the trailer, mark the vehicle, and then it automatically will line it up for you and you just drop it down and boop. Should be good. So Pretty easy to uh, do that, finally, now that I got it working. <laughs> uh, right. And then we gotta bring the Tahoe over and hook up the actual trailer. What I'm thinking, honestly, is instead of going out the way that we came, we could go down at the end of the runway and go in, but he said that was tight too, that trooper did. So we might take these dirt roads, the farm roads, honestly, and just go straight out of here. We'll cut across the field a little bit, and then we'll just go straight and kind of exit by that barn up there, I think, onto Union, I think might be the best. Um, these roads are just a little bit wider than trying to jank back out of there, so I'm thinking we'll just cut across here in a minute and, uh, and do that. I'm just going to check over some final things and make sure we're all good to go. We're good. Let's start <clears throat> getting out of here. All right, just go right over that. Cut through there. Actually, we... Mm, 
So we're going to go straight. I don't want to try to cut that right. So let's go straight here. And we're just going to take it right back home, essentially. Make this turn there. Woo, watch the hay bales. We're good. And we will be in the clear once we make this turn here. <gasps> Woo, okay, that scared me. All right, and get her through there. Boop. All good there. All right, um, I don't really know where we're going to park this, so we're just going to kind of leave it here for now. We're going to end up hitting that if we continue, so <laughs> it's whatever. We'll uh, have to find a parking space for this, but uh, yeah, went pretty well. Uh, we got a free escort by uh, state, and State Patrol did all that. That was pretty good. Um, we got up and flown just fine, no issues. Um, yeah, I mean, we'll have to probably take this out again, um, or maybe get some other people to join us with some of them. I think it'd be pretty cool to have a couple of them going up. Um, also, maybe we could look at doing, like, the uh, aircraft slash water. There's a plane that will land on water, and uh, we could try to do that at some point, maybe, in the future as well. So, you know, just kind of using some uh, different items that you don't normally see, so. But, uh... Anyway, I think that's going to wrap it up here. Appreciate everybody stopping by as well as all the uh, support from the last uh, video that we did, the Leo video. And uh, should be having another Leo one coming out soon. So stay tuned for that. But with that said, guys, I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.